You don't look like you sound. You do. I remember working with him like it was yesterday. It has been almost 20 years and I was quite young, but that's not an experience that one forgets. She and my daughter went to school together. You know, they were at, both at NYU, so I, 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 I stayed in touch vicariously, if that's the right way of saying it. And she's obviously a great talent. So she was bringing it. She knows how to hit the ball back over the net. You kill him? <laughs> I look like a guy who kills people. I'm warming to the possibility. <laughs> Too shit. Like it or not, you're a person of interest. I'm an interesting person. <laughs> it was very interesting working with him again the second time. My body felt the same feeling that I remember feeling all of those years ago, which is excitement and a little bit of nerves and wanting to be as prepared as possible. When Dakota Fanning and Denzel came together for the first couple scenes that we were shooting, you could feel the energy there because of their history. He definitely is an actor that keeps you on your toes constantly, and you are forced to be very present. He's known to add a different line in there or do something that's not in the script, so I was already prepared for that this time around. When Denzel did go off book, Dakota is so accomplished that she'll toss it back, and they have this witty repartee going. It's some of the most fun scenes in the movie.